Now, when we talk about geographic information systems or GIS, there are really three main types of data sources that we deal with. Let's start with public data sets. These are often put together by government agencies, research institutions, and international organizations. They provide us with a wealth of knowledge on various geographical aspects, such as demographics, land use, transportation, and environmental factors. These data sets are kind of like the bedrock for all sorts of applications, from city planning to preserving the environment. Now, private data sets are a whole different story. They're the secret sauce for many businesses and organizations, packed with stuff like customer details, sales figures, and juicy market insights that can really help when it comes to making big decisions. This kind of data often comes from fancy methods like aerial surveys, sensor networks, and other top secret ways of gathering information, giving businesses that extra edge in the competition. Last but not least, you have the process of creating your own data, which involves digitizing and mapping physical assets like land parcels, infrastructure, and buildings. Now, you can do this through a variety of different ways, including manual input, mapping efforts, and even integrating or editing third-party data sets. Plus, data can come from all sorts of places. Think sensor technologies for real-time data collection or field surveys to ensure you've got the full picture and utmost accuracy. By doing it this way, your organization can customize their GIS datasets to perfectly fit specific needs and requirements, making your spatial analysis and decision-making processes even more effective. If you'd like to learn more about GIS, be sure to follow us.